Good morning, I am on a cruise ship and in about seven hours from now my friends and I are gonna have a dance party on this helipad. These are my tips for how to have a great cruise. My friends and I, there were eight of us total, all organized by this guy, Michael. We just booked tickets on a regular old cruise, 2,100 other people going from Florida to Grand Cayman to Cozumel, Mexico. Here goes, first, wake up early. I love to wake up early on cruise ships because nobody's around and it's like you have the whole ship all to yourself. In fact, I made it a game to find spaces where I was the only one on the ship. There's something about cruise ships and museums, these huge spaces filled with people. When I can get them all to myself, it's when I like them the most. All right, strategic transport. The fastest way to get from one side of the ship to the other is to walk down the rooms only corridors. We also spend a lot of time going up the stairs. <laughs> cruise food is notoriously bad. This was no exception, but I ate all the time to try to stay healthy. Vegetables, you know, fruits, oh, seeds in my watermelon. I had a lot of vegetables to try to stay healthy. And of course, olive oil. I read so many books on cruises, but there's a free library on all the ships. This one was called The Book Nook. The books are best described as airport clearance. It's like books people bought at the airport and then decided not to read. Like, oh, this book I didn't really want, thanks. I wish I had one of these in my apartment in New York. You just stick it in the door and then magically someone comes and cleans your room. How cool is that? I could trash the room and then walk home, voila, everything's perfect. I took like eight naps a day and my room would always be made up. Random hall art everywhere on the ship, like this one and this one. Usually in these nooks and crannies in the stairwells, and they'd actually put museum cards next to them, like so you read up on them. They sold art in auctions, some was interesting, and lots more. You know, it really came down to the friends. We booked this to hang out together. We're a bunch of productivity nerds focused on self-improvement. People like Tasia and Richard, here's Jesse, Julia and Chris, there's me and Justice and Michael. Michael organized it, got everyone together and taught us these workshops. Each day we taught something that we could learn for real life skills. Like Michael talked about how to read Chinese good enough. This was real Chinese skills that we learned. Chris talked about Ray Dalio's book, Principles, and we did a lot of push-ups. Everyone did push-ups all the time, except for Julia, who didn't have upper body strength. <laughs> we had a lot of fun on this cruise. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please press the like button. It encourages me to make more videos with my friends. Have a great day. You are awesome.